monkey cult coffee. So does that mean we're in a cult? Yes. Okay, cool. Okay, cool but yes, this is monkey cult toasted coconut rum. Specialty grade. Oh God. Earth. Or artisanal coffee. Artisanal. Artisan anal. Artist anal? Yeah. <laughs> Artist anal coffee. Yeah. Okay, so a huge sorry to Monkey Colt because it's taking yeah, us forever to do this was, video. Yeah, this was very long overdue. So yeah, hopefully he's been going through a lot of crap life, but we're finally finally able to do this. So sorry, but here we go. Okay, so they recommend like any other company to drink it black. We're gonna try it black, then we're gonna mix it how we we sometimes it. like it, and then also how other people like it. So best of both worlds. So you can get an idea how it is by itself and mixed. Mm -hmm. For now, it's black. Mm -hmm. This is the toasted coconut rum. Yes, it is. Not, it's my first suggestion to make it, but yes, it's coconut rum. Well, if I'm not mistaken, when they offered to send us some, I think I told them like what we'd like, and they sent me a whiskey and you a rum. So this is, I think, it's more your, mine. Yeah. All right. Whoa, whoa. I taste the coconut and the rum. Ooh. You don't even really need to mix anything with that. All you honestly need is like a little bit of sugar to knock the bitterness off, which I'm gonna try. This one's already open. Okay. Well, I said little, but I think honestly that would do it. Like, the flavor's so good, I don't even think you'll need it. Yeah, that's perfect. No joke, you don't even need creamer. Keep going. Okay. Yeah, you don't even need creamer, because once you add that little bit of sugar to knock out the, the bitterness of the coffee, I'm not saying it needs it, I'm just saying, realistically, like, holy crap. Like the flavor of the coconut and the rum is like, holy crap. That's perfect. Good. Dude. Very good. I'm not even a rum guy. That's, that's some dang good coffee. Mm. I know it don't need any. I know. Let's go ahead. Oh, of course. Which one? Which? This one, I guess. Oh, it doesn't hold it for you. <laughs> so, it doesn't need it, like you said. Don't need it, but, but a little bit of cinnamon want... French toast creamer just to see how it mixes for the people that do creamers. I personally don't think it needs it. That was yeah, fantastic. I really don't need it, but I mean, it's good enough on its own, but for all you. Grim, you were going to melt. Keep stirring. Cause you got a bigger cup than I do. Okay. Try that. I didn't realize how good that creamer is. To be perfectly honest, the creamer kills the flavor of the coffee, but it's still good. He's gonna melt cause he's a huge cinnamon guy. Too late. So, if you're gonna drink this with creamer, do an unflavored creamer, but to be realistically honest, you really don't either mean. drink it black or, or black with a little bit of sugar. I mean, it's good with. I mean, it's great with sugar. I mean, I know it's good black, but if you're not a fan of black coffee because of the bitterness, just add like a little spoonful of sugar. It'll get rid of that bitterness, and then the flavor notes of the actual coffee shoot through the roof. Like, it almost tastes like you put creamer in it, as far as flavor goes, without even having to add anything. That's ridiculous. That is good. Yeah, again, Monkey Cult, we apologize for this taking yes. so long. But... We're, we're doing it now, though. Mm-hmm. Finally. Oh. 
But now I'm kind of sad that it took us this long because now I got to get more of this coffee. <laughs> Can you get this at stores or? I think you have to buy it direct. Of course. Well, that's fine. I don't mind helping out a uh, good business. And apparently they have something to do with the Pediatric Cancer Foundation. Oh, that's what it says on the back. It's in the boy in the mirror. Pack. Yeah, yeah, I, see, I, see, I, see, I see. I see. I see. I'm just oh like, crap! Oh. We're forgetting the most important part. Tasting notes. Yeah, do your thing. Read these since you like to read. All right. We're, we're going to about this flavor. Toasted coconut. We should have done this before, but whatever. Go for it. Oh. Toasted coconut rum is made with the finest specialty grade Honduran beans to give you a consistent, smooth flavor every time. Infused with toasted coconut and rum flavors, this remarkable combination is a perfect blend for all coffee enthusiasts. Ground to perfection by Master Roasters. To this unique small batch coffee is GMO free and made from 100% Arabic beans. That's pretty good. Yes. Tasty notes. Coconut washes over your palate while a sharp mm -hmm. touch of rum rests on the end of your tongue. Yep. We used a lighter roast to, to complement the natural fruity flavors of this amazing Honduran bean. Lightly yeah. acidic, but just enough to mix the tropical warmth of this newest creation. Yeah, I agree with that 100%. Pair as well with a touch of caramel or vanilla creamer. I have caramel over there. Okay. Well, we already drank it all. Yeah. Son of a... Sorry. Well, now we know to read the next one first. Because now we're on to the next one. Oh, you will. Next video. Yep, next time.